The Irish last kicker. What a career Becky Lynch has had so far here in WWE. Hey, listen, I remember when Becky Lynch first came to NXT. She had moved to Orlando, Florida to be a personal trainer. Never thought she'd get the opportunity to be part of this company. And now she is one of the premier superstars in our women's division. Credited with much of the women's evolution. Back at NXT, Charlotte was part of a group called the Four Horsewomen with Sasha Banks, Bailey, and Becky Lynch. Wow, has Charlotte evolved from those times? Corey, many people believe Charlotte may be the best pure athlete the women's division has ever seen. It's hard to argue that statement. Charlotte Flair has backed up every claim she has made since arriving in WWE. One day, she'll be joining her father in the Hall of Fame. Dating back to their days in NXT, Becky Lynch and Charlotte Flair have been best friends. They were part of the Four Horsewomen and Team PCB, but the two haven't always been sisters like they want you to believe. And, ugh. I wish an immediate end to their little tea time. It's absolutely absurd. No, it's cute. And I wouldn't at all be surprised if this match stole the show here tonight. Recalling your point about Becky Lynch's friendship with Charlotte Flair, Corey, Charlotte has been a major part of many important moments in Becky's career. You can't deny the bond between the two horsewomen. True, Michael, but not all moments were heartwarming. Remember when Charlotte brutally betrayed Becky in 2016? Charlotte's competitive nature always seems to supersede their friendship. Cover here. And the shoulder's up. Gonna take more than that. It's pretty amazing that in just a few short years, Charlotte has earned the moniker The Queen by ruling over every WWE show. Uh -oh. oh my goodness, crushing it! Byron, you mentioned Charlotte becoming the queen, and it shows with her regal entrance, high-priced robes, and flawless moves. With all the groundbreaking matches Charlotte's competed in, I'd love to see a queen of the ring tournament make that title official. Oh, oh. this is, what's this gonna be? Wheelbarrow, flapjack! Face first, it's over. Becky Lynch just too fast for her. Close line. Off with their head. Ah! 
Oh man, what a hit. Knocked right off the apron. Looks like she wants to beat her inside the ring. Look at her go. Wow, what a leg sweep. And then, oh, crushing the knee. She shows signs of life. She's showing a lot more than that. We'll see how long she can keep it up. by Becky Lynch. Two, three, suplex! What does Charlotte need to do now to remain a factor in this match? We're going to see what she's made of here, guys. She's not looking so good here, guys. She's going to need to find a way to fend off some of this offense, and quickly. Oh, no, we could be looking at a power bomb. I think you're right, Cole. Look out. She doesn't want to get counted out here. Well, she better get back in that ring then. Bringing it back between the ropes. Eight. I'm having a hard time figuring out what they're going to do next. Boom, what impact. Oh, talk about getting flattened. Yeah, she's going to be feeling that one for a while. And a pin attempt. Not much behind that pin attempt. She came here to fight, not lay down. Man, this has been a great matchup. Impact. I'm not sure Charlotte should be showing up her competition like this. You can see the confidence just beaming from her right now. I always find it interesting to see how these teams interact. There are so many unique personalities, and oftentimes they don't necessarily mesh well. Going to have a hard time stopping Becky when she's doing this. Five. Becky is showing her stuff right now, big time. She dodges that one. Becky Lynch, nice exploder suplex. But is it enough to end it? Look at this. This one's not over yet. She's more durable than she looks, guys. She's calling her out. Here we go, Becky Lynch setting it up. Slam. That's it. That's what she needed. I think Becky, she goes for the cover. And you could put this singles match in the books. Let's look back on the action from the last match. Who could forget this? She's taking care of business. That's a woman on a mission. And last but not least, there was this.
Nicely done. Picking up the win here. I got a feeling we're going to be talking about her for a long time to come. And give this Houston crowd credit for being on their feet almost the entire...